Hey guys, what's up? It's the Knife Enthusiast here coming at you with another for sale video on my brand new Unbox Benchmade 42. Now I actually made a for sale video on this knife about a week ago, um, but I actually got a lot of negative or mad, upset comments about the premium price I had put on it. I put a premium price on it because that's what I thought it was worth, and a lot of people were getting very upset and very mad that I had priced it at the premium price I did, which makes no sense because it's just pricing. I don't know why people were getting that upset about it. But I never really uh, specified or gave a reason reasons why I priced it the way I did. So before I show you what I have for sale here today, I want to just go over those reasons uh, for you guys. So the first reason is because it's been out of production since 2009, which means that they no longer are being made. Uh, the only way you can find them is on the secondhand market at gun shows or buy it from a collector who wants to sell it. In most cases, you're going to find a used Benchmade 42. It might be good condition, it might be moderate, bad, but for most cases, it's really kind of hard to find a new in box Benchmade 42. Second reason is because many people consider it to be one of the best battle songs ever made. It's become very popular because it has been appeared in I believe some TV show, not TV shows, some movies, uh, specifically uh, Kick-Ass, the first Kick-Ass, it was used in that one, which gained a lot of popularity. And also a lot of uh, YouTubers started flipping with these knives and doing tutorials with them, so everybody wanted them based on those. So it is a very uh, sought after knife uh, because of those reasons as well. The third reason is because it is rare. You cannot find these very easily on the market. They do not show up all the time. They show up very rarely. I mean, finding one is uh, actually very hard for um, a lot of people, and they just don't pop up as frequently as uh, the demand requires. So there's a lot of demand, but not as many 42s to go around or that pop up for sale. So that is also uh, a reason why it's priced that uh, way. And the fourth reason was because this is a brand new in box 42, which means that it has never been flipped or used, and it's just been in its box since it was purchased uh, from Benchmade themselves. So finding a Benchmade 42 is rare in itself, but finding one that's brand new in box, that's even more rare. So that's why the premium price was priced the way it was. And uh, this was a rare collectible piece that... Uh, should uh, that should bring a collectible price, but um, that was just you know the reasoning that I had uh, behind the premium price. So let's go ahead and show you the knife. So we'll start off with the box. As you can see, it's this custom or not custom, this uh, original Benchmade blue box. Only flaw with the box is that there was a sticker here, but it was ripped off and took off some of the paint as well. That's the only flaw with the box. Probably the whole flaw with the whole package here. Uh, so there you go, handle with care, and here's the original logo, 42 Battle Song Titanium. Let's take it out. So, take this out for a minute. Has the paperwork here, which has no smudges, not crinkled, looks like it was brand new from, you know, 2009 when it first, you know, the last run kind of thing or whenever this one was made. I don't know the specific date it was made, but it's brand new, everything basically, except for the box a little bit from the outside. Sheath, perfect condition. No dirt or scuffs or anything like that, or de-wrinkling or whatever, I don't know. Uh, and there's no problem with the sheath is what I'm trying to get at. So let's get to the knife. Let's pull this out here, get the main event. Let's do some close-ups, close-up footage here. So as you can see, perfect condition. Is a re it is a real Benchmade 42. So I'll go down the knife handles. Not a scratch or a scuff on it. No dings because it's never been flipped. It's never been used or flipped, like I said. So there's the, those handle sides. Here's this handle. The torque screws, by the way. So that's the handle. And we'll just go ahead and pop the spring latch open. Get you guys a nice look at the spring latch. The spring latch is basically the key factor of determining whether a 42 is real or not. So as you can see, this is a real 42. It's got the nice thick uh, barrel there with the round dome on the bottom and the top. I like to call it the mushroom shaped latch, but uh, that's just my, me, my opinion. So it's round at the top. There's the top view round at the bottom. There's a good look at the handles from the bottom. 
So, and then there's the, there it is from the top. So there's the full shot of the knife for all of you to see. If I could zoom in here. All right, there we go. So there it is. Now we'll open it up very gently. It hasn't been opened that much. So we'll start very good close up. Hopefully it'll zoom in very well. As you can see, the blade is in pristine condition. No dirt, grime, scratches, scuffs, anything. It is a mere looking edge here, or a mere looking, uh, it almost looks like a mirror, like a mirror polish on the blade. Just very nice, that Weehawk blade there. There's a zoom in of the logo. Also a key factor to, to determining if a Benchmade Battle Song is real or not. There it is. Back side. 154 CM Benchmade USA. So we'll go ahead and flip this over, show you the other side of the blade. There's the blade. Pristine condition. There is absolutely nothing wrong with the blade or the handles. Perfect condition. There's the spine. Only problem with the spine is there's a little oil there. I guess. I don't know what that is. It's off though. Just got it off. There's a slight little piece of dust there. It wasn't even anything major. Just rubbed it off with my finger. So there it is. There's the whole knife. So you get the good look at that. We'll look at the channel in here. So there's the channel. Channel style titanium balisong. Very nice. I like the detailed cutouts that they have on the 42. It's very nice. Legendary flipper for, it's, it's just a legendary flipper. I just love going over this knife because it is my favorite battle song that I've ever owned. And this one is brand new in box, so I'm glad that it will be going to a new home where hopefully it'll be flipped or sold to someone eventually where it can be flipped. So I uh, really like this knife, but uh, i got to let it go. Uh, right now, I don't really have a uh, set price that I'm going to ask for it. Uh, I have a price in mind that I would like to get for it, but right now I'm just doing best offers. So uh, send me your best offers for the knife. Uh, just, you know, whatever you want to do. Uh, I'll leave my email address in the description box. You can comment down below with um, your offer. So you can offer me anything, but I will decline offers. I'll accept offers and that kind of stuff. So thank you guys for watching. I'll show you the box actually before I end this video. Uh, one more thing before I actually do end this video um, is that uh, the offers must uh, be money or trade offers so if you want to offer me a trade for another battle song you are more than welcome to do that just uh that would probably be something you would rather email me than to leave a comment uh, comment for so if you want to email me for trade offers that's the way to do it so if you do have a trade offer that you would like to trade me for this 42 send me an email if you have a offer for a price that you want to throw at me then you can leave it in the comments or you can email me that as well. So um, also I will only be doing trades for battle songs, nothing else. So if you have a folder or anything like that, I'm not interested, just battle songs for trade. So that's the end of my video guys. Uh, hope you like it. Like I said, uh, send me an offer by leaving a comment or sending me an email. So that's everything. Sheath, papers, box, knife, boom, done. This has been The Knife Enthusiast. Subscribe, like this video, and I will see you next time.